Hello everybody, and welcome back to more LEGO Marvel Super Heroes. When we left off, I Venom. I, I found that you could do that with Venom, and that's pretty cool. Um, but we're actually on our way to Thor, so let's go see the big man. Who is over here somewhere. I can't actually see the Bifrost anymore, but that helpful arrow is serving as a rather handy stand-in. Yeah. So it appears that he has appeared at the docks for some reason. Not entirely sure why, but I'll just explore this a little bit. Get that all mapped. Lovely. I'm getting better at controlling the flying as well. Oh yeah, I'm no longer utterly terrible at it. Most of what S.H.I.E.L.D. knows about Thor and his people remains highly classified. What little information we've obtained about his home, Asgard, comes from, well, this one children's book found by Dr. Eric Selvig in New Mexico. Seems pretty accurate so far. You're not very good at these briefings, are you, Maria? You could just check Wikipedia, you know. But hey, Thor. Get a load of this guy. Ooh, very theatrical with the lightning and everything. He is the god of thunder. It's sort of his thing. I sense the opening of the vortex because brother Loki used it as a pathway to Asgard. What the heck's he after? He is ever after only one thing. Power. And also helmets with horns. He was ah. really into those. <laughs> I like Thor. <laughs> this is great! Better than any roller coaster! Nice. I'm not, I'm not sure who I'm playing as. I think I'm Cap. Crying. Wolverine takes up a lot of space, you know. This is awesome. This is this is great. This is I'm bouncing off all the walls. I'm only vaguely controlling the direction that Cap is moving in. Whee! Is that Deadpool? It's fucking of course it's fucking Deadpool. Oh. Holy shit. Let's not do that again. Whoa, I'm so dizzy I'm seeing stars. But no stripes. So much frost and ice. Loki must be working with the frost giants of Jotunheim. Okay that good, I always bring the heat. Yeah. That that is that that is beautiful. What's happening here? That looks awesome. Rose to the exit of Baron. Must remove this ice somehow. Now, if there were only someone here with the power to melt ice. Whee! Oh yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Thor is so cool. Oh look, he can shoot the choo choo. Okay, I'm definitely playing as Thor in future, just in general. Holy crap, he's awesome. Now, I saw some things in here, some studs. Apparently, it does not want me to have them. Right. Let's get to it. Okay, there's far too much ice in here for me to just melt all of it. So, we'll melt a little bit of it and then be done. At least that's the plan. Frost giants, be on your guard. Hmm. Funny, they don't look so giant to me. Wolverine raises a valid point. I'm sorry, Steve Bloom raises a valid point. Dude, dude, do you mind? I'm busy. Kid, fuck off. The camera is not my friend here. You are trapped in the observatory. For a way out. Oh, Stan Lee! Stan Lee is here! I heard him cry for help, and I saw him cry for help also. Guys, can you please do something? Let me just try and rescue Stan Lee first. Oh, okay. Ooh, let's break all this though. I'm here, I may as well break everything. Up. 
Stats, 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 glorious stats. At least Wolverine's fighting properly. Oh yeah, I forgot when Wolverine dies, he goes down to his adamantium skeleton. That's actually kind of creepy, to be honest. That's, that's, that's a bit creepy. But never mind. I don't know if I'll get anything for smashing all these. I probably won't, but I'm, it's quite fun. Back off. Right, I'm, I'm going to melt all the ice until I find Stan Lee, because he must be here somewhere. Stands to reason in a room full of ice, he's somewhere in the ice. Stan Lee! No, no sign of him yet. Can't go any further down. Oh, there's a silver thing there that can be smashed. That's actually probably what he's underneath. I don't think any of my people here can smash it unless Thor can. Nope. Oh, I can even blast shit. Thor can do so much cool stuff. Nice. Pew. Oh, that's time to sword. Cool. I have to say, the uh, Thor and Thor 2, I'm a big fan of mythology, as those of you who saw my Age Mythology uh, playthrough will know, but Norse mythology is one of my favourites, and I really love the Thor and Thor 2 films, just the, all, as well as the mythology in them, they're just absolutely freaking beautiful. I mean, this is in Lego, and it looks beautiful. The actual films are just gorgeous, like the architecture and all the stuff and everything. It's great. And this is, yeah, that's, it's beautiful, it's beautiful. Now let's get out of, this is just the observatory as well. Let's get out and see Asgard proper. Oh, look at that. Fucking Lego. A magical rainbow bridge. What next? Unicorns and happy cliches. Damn it, Steve Bloom, can't you be happy for once in your life? Where's my hammer? Where's my hammer? There it is. Wait. I'm just stand here and do this now. I could if any more were coming. Cowards! Come and face the god of thunder. That's it. That's it. How's that working out for you, eh? <laughs> Suckers. Sorry. Not this bridge. We may as well do some community service while we're here. Apart from killing all the ice chunks. Oh no, that just made the situation worse. He said, continuing to attack it. Damn, look at this place. It's beautiful. <laughs> Eat fire, frost giants. Your mortal enemy. Well, technically, dragon type would be your mortal enemy, perhaps. Ah, dickhead. I mean, hornhead. I was beginning to worry. Shut up. Do you like what I've done with the place? No, it's really cold. <sighs> Dickhead. Now how are we going to use the gate for its intended purpose? Oh, just chill out for a second, won't you? Oh great, even Loki is making puns. Actually I get the feeling that Loki will be pretty big on puns when not playing by Tom Hiddleston. Yeah. Or even well played by Tom Hiddleston. Tom Hiddleston's probably big on puns. He seems, he seems like the sort. He's, he's cool. Probably big on puns. Well. Sometimes I wish I had regenerating abilities. Like you. Behold! You are now under my power. That uh, fucking idiot's in the way. I can't. I, there we go! Finally! Ta -ta for now. See you, dickhead. I, um, let's smash this statue, shall we? I, I imagine first I need to... Yeah. Yeah, lovely. I think first I'm probably going to have to uh, charge it. No? Oh, it's magnetic powers, okay. 
<sighs> I really must learn what everything is. That's just metal. Okay, it is as simple as just melt the ice on the door. It is a good thing that the human torch just happened to be with us. Ah, green. Apparently certainly need the Hulk for that. Oh, Thor can do it too. Oh, Thor, your dad is going to be so pissed at you. You shouldn't have lost your key. Damn. So this is Asgard. Why do you insist on following me, brother? Because you iced everything the fuck up. Look at this place. If I can move, that'd be dandy. There we go. A flying character. If only I had two of those. Die. <laughs> Don't know why a shield fucking terminal is here. Never mind. Going somewhere. <laughs> ah. Not. Oh! Oh, holy hell! Sir. There we go. Oh, that's quite nicely handled. Oh. Someone's going to have to rebuild that. It's not going to be me. Yet again, you fall for my simple apologies. If by simple partner tricks you mean I punched you in the face and you had to build a new, you had to destroy this thing to get away, then yes, yes, I suppose I did. Pew, pew. I don't know what all this stuff does. Stuff everywhere. Um. Oh, Spidey sense can be used here. I guess. Oh no, Chloe sense, Wolverine sense. Wolverine. Oh, that's still an issue. Uh. No. Okay, I'm assuming there's something I've. Uh, Thor is just playing with his hammer. That's what I would do in his circumstances. I assume there's just. Wait, is that a statue of Loki already? No, no, it isn't. I was gonna say, how the hell do they do that so fast? There must be something I'm missing for removing the ice. Let's remove all the ice. Let's move the ice over here as well. That might help. Ah, uh, that's... Okay, that probably won't help. I don't know what's through there, or what's the point how I get in there. What about this bit of ice? That's pretty cool, though. It melts just from me being near it. Or at least it throws off stuff. Just from the human torch being right next to it. Okay, so this is all just the scenery. I wait. I know. This is probably for building. Yep. One day I will learn that building is always probably the solution, and if not, just br I know for a fact that break everything is always the solution in Lego games. How convenient the human taught took that skill in astro architecture. Phew, that was lucky. I thought I was going to have to restart it then. Oh. Was it some kind of lift? Or an elevator, if you are American? No. Let me charge up my hammer again because why in the hell wouldn't you? I mean, look at this. That, that. They didn't even get close to me. They're all dead now. Ugh, fuck off. There we go.
I don't even know if this is going to help me at all. I just enjoy breaking things. Ooh, look, a tree. That's nice. There's a tree. You down here, Wolverine? Nah. There's a bit of ice. Can get behind the ice? Yeah, that is cool. The ice melts just from the human torch being nearby. That's nifty. Oh, one of those. I haven't seen one of them in a while. Go, Wolverine. Use your mighty muscles. Put that Canadian metal to the test. Still, oh, metal test. Shut up, Tom. Quiet. Are we having fun? But Wolverine is Canadian. And very short. It's like five foot five. You heroes are mere puppets under my control. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. There we go. At some point, Loki, you're gonna have to you're gonna run out of places to hide. Not yet, obviously, but soon. Possibly. I can confirm that at some, okay, that guy's glitching on the left. I can confirm that at some point in the future, Loki, you will run out of places to hide. I can't bother to get that other flowery thing because I'm pretty sure I missed one further back because it was behind those screens I couldn't figure out. What is that? Oh, it's one of these. Everybody on board. Ooh, purple and blue. <gasps> it's false. Or something. <clears throat> I'm not entirely sure. Because if Wolverine's anyone who can tell it's false, then how did Thor hit it with that? I don't know. Let's burn this thing. I don't know what destroying this statue is going to accomplish, I'll be quite honest. Then again, I don't know what half the stuff, destroying half the stuff in the Marvel, in uh, Lego games is going to accomplish, but normally it accomplishes something. Oh, a fountain. Oh, flowers. I'm not finished yet. Or should that be, we're not finished yet? It, only, it helps if you're going to make a statement like that. If we know who you're, like, if, if we know what's going on, Loki. Otherwise, it's just lost on us. And yes, I'm sure you feel very clever now, but you're not because you've excluded others from your conversation by being deliberately obfuscating. How foolish you are! Ah. 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 Well, better get bashing. <laughs> one of you's got to be the real one. Over here. Okay, Wolverine, do some sniffing. <gasps> it's a real one. Ha! <laughs> Look at that human torch. It's just like, man, fuck the cutscene. I'm going to finish this guy. We build this over the door then. That seems like the only reasonable option. What the hell did I just power up? Oh, another door. I've only just noticed. Look at Cat Cap's breath. It's frosting. All their breaths are frosting. That's cool. Shiny and cold. Is dangerous, brother. Oh, and so am I, yeah. brother. I intend to get my revenge. I forgot we were chasing that. On Earth and on Asgard. What are you planning, Loki? You can't make me tell. You are not the god of me. Oh, thou dost vex me with that taunt. You've used it since we were children. 
Do you remember this little play thing? <laughs> oh dear. I was just about to say, is he going to go for the destroyer armor? And I'm fairly sure he has done just that. Yep. Okay, so don't get too close. Somebody let me out. I'm in the ice block on the left. I'm actually, I'm actually gonna have to switch to try and get. There we go. Four is out. Let's try and put a stop to this dickhead. Okay, lightning does not work. On the plus side, I seem to be invincible, so that's nice. Human torch. I, the only thing I can think of doing is burning out these statues. Oh, it's one out of three things. Stop saying that. You keep making me think I, I need to use Wolverine. <laughs> Thing is indestructible. Oh, smashy things. A way to break Loki's control over it. Well, if you guys have any bright ideas, I'd love to hear them. That claws ain't gonna do it this time. We've got gotta be, be another way. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, we need to stand for that, but okay. Suck it, Loki. My stand! Mortal pest! The destroyer is vulnerable. Take him out. Ooh. Right in the boobs. Be gone! Asgard belongs to me! And everybody keep an eye out for building things. Okay, I really hoped that melting that was going to give me something. It gave me nothing. Um, oh, what about melting this? Perhaps that will give me something. This is somewhat gambler's fallacy, but never mind. Holy crap. Ah, oh, what I'm after. Cool, that was easy. I'm not sure if that came down because of anything I did or if it just came down. <laughs> no! Die, Loki! Ah! You pathetic insect! Now use Thor's hammer to attack the destroyer. Gee. Thanks, game. Ding. Just twice more now. You shall never win. Really? Because it looks like we're winning. Even if I keep doing this. Especially if I keep doing this, nothing can do anything about it. Even my friends are getting horribly murdered by it. I'm a team player, you see, audience. Oh. I'll just take off on the ground then, because that hurts. I'm just going to hover up here until something happens. Brother, I do not wish you further Case in off. point. Give up now. Burn. I just really don't seem to take damage about half the time. It's 
quite peculiar. Like that, the destroyer should have just completely killed me. Nice. I swear, you will kneel before me by the time this day is nope. through. Voiced by John Middleton, perhaps, but otherwise, no. Not happening. Right, oh, going to head this time. Yeah. Well, that's that dealt with. You think you have me outnumbered? Will not for long. Stop bowing. You already pulled this trick, Loki. Granted, I think there were nine of you then. No. No, it definitely shouldn't. Wolverine. Cannot be. No. Get away, you foul creature. I'm gonna finish him with Thor. There we go. Hit him with the hammer. Return the Tesseract to the safekeeping of the treasure room. Hey, Blondie, I hate to point this out, but it just got stolen from there. Maybe your security is not so good. S.H.I.E.L.D. has an entire battalion of troops dedicated to guarding the Tesseract. Humans guarding this item of immense power. Please, I can rain thunder and lightning on anyone who touches it. What's Wolverine doing? <laughs> I bet this glow cube can help me find Magneto. I can ask Chuck about that. God damn it, Wolverine! Still, at least his instinct is the correct one, and that is to ask Professor Xavier, because that's generally the right thing to do in almost any situation. Maths problem? Ask Professor Xavier. Being hunted by humans for being different? Ask Professor Xavier. Totally buying the miniature destroyer. What was I doing? Oh yeah, Professor Xavier. It's pretty awesome, basically. And I look forward to seeing him. But that will have to wait until next episode. Because this episode ran out of time, like, when the boss fight started. And then it went on for like 50 fucking minutes. So we'll just, um, we'll just go through these. I'll roll my eyes at Wolverine a few more times. Continue story. Ooh. That very... So you will rule the earth. Yes, yes. But where is the power source you promised me? It's all we need. I know where it is. We can acquire it from the mutants. The X-Men? Very well. I've planned for every contingency. I'll dispatch some associates to reacquire it. Hmm. Yeah, you're finally going to the X-Men. I was looking forward to this. Brought you something, Professor. Figure this can help us find Magneto. The only thing I think it will find for us is unwanted attention. Hmm. Uh, oh dear. Oh, that doesn't sound good. And that doesn't look good. Mystique and Magneto, oh dear. X-Men, well. do you read me? Our sensors indicate that the X-Mansion is under attack. If you're receiving this message, you should get there right away. Well, that's fun. And it, hearing Coulson talk to the X-Men really makes me want an X-Men film done by Marvel. But this is... I, this, okay, so Jean Grey obviously has psychic abilities. And is, I, she keeps doing that. Oh, and I can shield. I don't know how, but... Apparently I have to do it like that. So that's cool. I can... Pew, 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 pew. It's side last. This is just a your bog standard laser. Nothing fancy. And your default attack is a fucking punch, even when you've got eye lasers. At least I can use the eye lasers. Okay, regardless, that is all for this episode, I think. So, thank you all for watching. Join me next time when we get into the X Mansion. And, um, 
And put out those fires somehow. They need putting out, don't they? They definitely need putting out. So, thank you for watching, and I will see you soon.